Yes, hello everybody. Welcome back to my Minecraft Zoo series. It's been a while, been a while. Um yeah, huge update at the zoo. We got a new up we got a new entrance. Boys, we did it. We did it, boys, we did it. In here the path has been updated epic, 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 very good. It actually looks very good now. Over here, we, the capybaras are still the same, apart from I put some wood and stuff around, like here, here, and here, just every now and then. Nothing changed with the tapirs, they're still tapirs. They're still cool. I don't, I don't know why, I don't... Here's the thing, I feel like their pond, I, oh yeah, actually, 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 I made their pond a bit bigger. Only by a bit, but it's a bit bigger. Ooh, what is that I see? Something I'm very proud of. Dun, 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 dun. Oh, come on, that's the second time that's happened today. If I had a, if I had a coin for every time that happened... I'd have two coins, which isn't a lot, but it's crazy how it happened twice. Anyone watch Phineas and Ferb here? The sign is uh, chimpanzees. Yeah, baby. Really proud of the entrance. It's, first of all, it looks really good in my opinion. You look in here, you can see the chimps. There's eight of them in this really big enclosure. Massive took me very long time. Uh, yeah, the chimps look really good. I uh, got them a small pond because they're afraid of deep water. A rock wall, bamboo. There's shelters in here. The shelter—they actually do go in the shelter. No, don't run away. Uh, yeah, they've got fallen trees. Uh, they've got a big open path, so they don't have to be crowded around the trees. They can be in the open if they so wish. Uh, they can't escape from the rock wall, luckily. Um, yeah. Um, oh, yes, I should probably explain the, the type of wall I used. So, you see, this, you see this stuff? The mesh. I used it so if they tried to escape, they'd get zapped. Plus, it's on a weird lip. So if they go up like this, like I am, they can't get over. And if they do, they go, they try to touch this and they go, and fall back down. Oh, we've got a glass ex observer area for all the people who want to see the chimps. Uh, yeah. We've got some small grass. Oh yeah, I've also tried something new with terraining and trying to lift certain parts up. I quite like it. It could be improved, but overall, I think this one looks really good. Uh, yeah. I I don't know what, what else to say except that I really like this. The chimps look good. Uh, oh yeah, in here there's a bit of a sky open area, so light gets natural light gets in. Uh, they've got hay, some dirt path, which kind of looks like trampled hay. Don't at me. Uh, chimps, once again, that's good. I also put on um, barrier blocks. Uh, da -da -da -da. These things on top of the bamboo so they don't grow uncontrollably. Un uncontrollably. Uh, we have three big trees. The rest are just normal. And yeah. This is... I, did, I don't have a door for the keepers because it might be a bit dangerous because chimps are dangerous. They're very, very good model, by the way. Well done, white creatures. Well done. Overall, I, in my opinion, I would rate this enclosure a 7 out of 10. Pretty good. Could be better. But overall, I think it's my favourite so far. Just because of its size, its its foliage and all that jazz. So, I will see you 
hopefully next time. And I'm planning on doing a aquatic creature next, so stay tuned for that. Bye-bye, everybody.